Hi guys, welcome to Tech View Hub. On this video tutorial, we are going to see how we can create timer on Android. For this, first we are going to create text view and three buttons on activity main.xml. So next we are going to create text view. Setting the layout width and height as wrap content. Setting the text as 0. And text size as 60 dp. And then positioning it in the required place. Next we are going to create three buttons and naming it as start, stop and reset and placing it below the text view. Next we are going to add IDs to text view and the three buttons. Next we are moving to main activity dot java. Here we are declaring the timer. Three buttons start, stop and reset. and the text view.
Next we are adding find view by id to buttons and the text view. Next we are declaring the boolean value. And declaring the num and initializing it to 1. Next we are adding set on click listener to the start button. Inside it we are adding if statement. Inside the if statement we are adding logical node to the value and declaring the start method and then changing the value to true. Next we are creating the start method. Initializing the timer and adding the timer task to it. So inside the timer task we are executing the timer functionality. Since we are making the changes on the UI of the app, we will be adding main activity dot this dot run on UI trait. So inside this we will be making changes on our text view. And inside this we will be adding the int num. Since int is the integer we will be adding string dot value of to this. Since we need to increment the value of num while clicking on the start button, we are adding num is equal to num plus 1. So next we need to make this timer change for every once again. In order to execute this, we will be adding schedule function to the timer. So timer dot uh, schedule 
inside this we are adding the timer task with the delay of 1 second so we have added timer functionality on the start button next we are going to set stop and reset button in order to do this we are adding set on click listener to the reset button inside this we are setting the text view as 0 since we are resetting it and we are adding timer dot cancel and making the num to 0 and changing the value to false so after this we are creating set on click listener to the stop button and inside this we are uh, cancelling the timer and changing the value to false now we are running the app So if we click on the start button, the timer is running. If we click on start, it stopped. Then again clicking on start, it's resuming. Then clicking on reset, it is going back to zero. So timer functionality is executed successfully. Thanks for watching the video.